My name is Alessandra. I am oceanographer from University of São Paulo in Brazil. Hi, I'm Erika. I am a Brazilian scientist. I, I do research with uh, biological oceanographic. Hi, I'm Ana Luisa. I'm 24 years old. I'm the founder and CEO of Sustainable Development and Water for All. I always was uh, curious about life in ocean and uh, that's why I decided to take uh, this as a profession. I think the science and the research is extremely important to understand uh, the ocean, the ecosystem, so what's there, who is there, and to protect and to develop a management plan. You need to know what you want to protect. When I was a child, I always was passionate about sciences and I wanted to do something to solve a big problem. Uh, when I was 15 years old, I discovered that the water issue in the northwest of Brazil were affecting a lot of families that didn't have water. So I decided to do something to solve uh, or help solve this problem. Then I started to, to uh, search for what I could do and I discovered about a methodology that could clean the water using just the sun radiation, specifically the UV light. So the main challenge that I needed to solve basically was funding, access to funding. Uh, when I was 15 I didn't have any kind of support nor to laboratories nor to finance the prototypes. I needed to do everything by my own and with the help of my family. Everything was, oh you need to show some kind of results so we can understand that this is a good idea to fund. But how could I show something if I didn't, ha didn't have the support to begin in every community that we help we know that we are not delivering just a water solution a sanitation solution we uh, we received several testimonials of mothers of families that uh, they know that the, the child was sick and uh, after we, we deliver the solution they they could achieve uh, a better improvement of life uh, it was when I have uh, um, my my son I was uh, in the beginning of my master. I, I just realized that uh, I have uh, no friends, no colleagues in this position, that they have to face daily life with uh, taking care of a kid and at the same time doing research. So sometimes this can be very tough for a woman. And this is uh, actually give me the feeling of empowerment and uh, how can I make it the difference for other women in this uh, position to not give up of their dream, of their career, and continues working with uh, what they love.